Good morning, Miss Epstein. Happy Monday. I hope you have had a lovely, lovely weekend. So, I'm back again with another literacy lesson, and it's Monday, which means we've got some new tricky words and a brand new story, and it's a really good one this week, so I hope you like it. So, first, let's read what our tricky words are going to be this week. So, the first tricky word is, my turn, me, your turn. Well done. Let's see what the next one's going to be. My turn, my, your turn. It's in. And last one, my turn, you, your turn. So maybe you can have a go at writing those today for me. Right, so let's have a look what our story's called. <gasps> Pirates love underpants. Oh, that's a bit cheeky, isn't it? Pirates love underpants. <gasps> I wonder if you can make a prediction of what our story might be about. <gasps> These pirates so love underpants. They're on a special quest to find the fabled pants of gold for the captain's treasure chest. Anchors away, the captain cries. Hoist up black bloomers, sail, unfurl the tre secret treasure map. Pants, pirates never fail. Black bloomer bobs upon the wave, so that's the ship. The captain shouts, hooray! Sharks in fancy underpants, we found Big Knickers Bay. Ooh, that's funny. The pirates grab their cutlasses and row their boats to shore. But yikes, me arties, what is this? Someone's been here before. Oh no, somebody's already been there. The footprints led through shifting dunes across the three pants ridge. Snap, snap, snarl, hungry crocodiles beneath the Long John Bridge. Uh oh the pirates wade through gurgling swamps, through caves as black as night. They trek through prickly undergrowth, then... Nope. <gasps> oh, what a sight! <gasps> We're here too late, the pirates gasp. Another pirate crew. They found the golden underpants. What are we going to do? <gasps> oh, no. The captain has a cunning plan. It's clever. It's fantastic. Grab their fancy underpants and cut through the elastic. <gasps> oh no, so what's going to happen if their elastic has been cut in their pants? <gasps> Shh, as the rival pirates sleep, they snip around on tiptoe. But help, the captain's parrot squawks and wakes them up. Oh no, uh oh. Grab those pants, the captain roars. They're after us, oh ah! But with their pants around their feet, they don't get very far. <gasps> oh no, they're tripping and rolling down the hill. Yo ho, 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 the pirates dance. Fine treasure fills our hold. But what's the booty we love best? The glittering pants of gold. Oh, they found all the treasure and the special gold pants. <gasps> so when you put your pants on, check. The elastic is in place. All like those silly pirates found, you'll have a bright red face. <gasps> and look, what can you see in his toy box? <gasps> you can see the black bloomer, the pirate ship, and you can see the captain. And he's checking that his underpants have got the elastic in in case they fall down. That's a funny story, isn't it? So, that's the story that we're going to be, help going to be using to help us learn lots and lots of literacy skills. So, your activity today is to have a go at making your old pirate. You could use some junk modelling, you could draw it, you could do it however you want. But, you must design and give them some really funky underpants. So, if I was to give my pirate some underpants, I would probably make them bright pink with some flowers on. <laughs> Just to make them a little bit funny. So, I can't wait to see all your amazing pirates. So make sure you put it onto tapestry so me, Mrs. Moorcroft, or Mrs. Harrison can see how amazing you are doing at home. Okay? I hope you have a wonderful week. I'll see you again tomorrow with another interesting literacy lesson. Okay? See you all soon. Bye, reception.